Now, my last stop on this wonderful tour of Budapest is this gorgeous park. Now, it is the oldest and it's right in the heart of the city. So, these gorgeous old buildings around the outside. It's been here for hundreds of years. It's got one of the best tree collections that you'll find anywhere in Budapest. And it's a great place to come and spend time to get a break away from this bustling city. Grab a coffee, come and sit down, soak it up. Come on, I'll show you around. The Karol Yi Kurt or garden is enclosed between the high buildings of Budapest city. It's nestled in the very centre of the city and the oldest garden in all of Budapest. It's a French style garden that was originally a private garden to Count Anatole Karol Yi. And it's known for its beautiful plants and flowers, which were collected from across the globe and line the romantic pathways. See this gorgeous tree up here. It's one of my favourite trees that you'll find in parks right throughout Europe, all coloured up this time of the year. It's a wonderful autumn tree known as the horse chestnut. Now, the horse chestnut grows basically through southern Europe right across into Asia. It will grow in Australia, but you need a lot of room. They get up to 35 metres tall. They also produce these nuts, conkers, which you can play marbles with. A lot of fun. The park also features statues. Note the one of the revered Carolee, a Belgium giant rabbit and former park resident. Apparently rabbits were not uncommon in the early days and the garden was impacted significantly by events such as World War II where it was severely damaged and communism that saw it left in a state that was not too good for some period of time. This has to be one of the most beautiful trees you'll ever find. It's a deciduous conifer, which is unusual in its own right. But the ginkgo tree, well, it's an ancient precursor to modern day conifers. In fact, this one here produces a fruit, which you can see, and inside it, the ginkgo nut is incredibly good in so many different ways for our human health. But only 300 years ago, it was nearly extinct in its native China. Once was in forests all over the planet, we often find that there's fossil records of this that date back nearly 200 million years. That was until it was rediscovered and it's been spread around the globe. And here is a gorgeous example of just how beautiful this tree can be in the autumn months. This is all, of course, part of the experience for Viking cruise passengers who start their grand European journey right here in Hungary before traveling the rivers through Austria, Germany, and eventually arriving in Holland. There's a lot of sights to see and I'll share some more gardens as we cruise through the autumn with the goal of sharing some European garden inspiration for you too. And remember, if you want to experience this for yourself, check out the Viking Cruises website. They have over 70 river ships and also they've won the best cruise ship company for four years in a row.